searching for lasting happiness, discover the essential secret to unlocking joy from within and transform your life. Have you ever chased happiness? Maybe you thought a new job would make you happy, or perhaps a new house would bring you joy. But those things fade, the joy is gone. True joy is different, it lasts much longer. It is a deep feeling inside you. You can find this joy. It is waiting for you. Joy is not about what happens to you. It is about how you see the world. It is about how you see yourself. When you are joyful, you feel good no matter what. Your problems seem smaller. You feel strong and hopeful. You're ready for anything. We all want to be happy. But many of us look in the wrong places. We chase after things that only bring temporary happiness. We buy things we don't need. We worry about things we can't control. This does not bring us joy. It only brings us stress. True joy comes from within. It comes from appreciating what we have. It comes from being kind to ourselves and others. It comes from living a life of purpose. When we find joy within, we are truly happy. Many people use joy and happiness interchangeably, but they are not the same. Happiness is a feeling. It comes and goes. Joy is deeper. It is a state of being. Think of it like this. Happiness is like the weather. It changes all the time. One day it is sunny. The next day it is rainy. Joy is like the sun. It is always there, even when you can't see it. Happiness often depends on external factors. You get a promotion, you win the lottery, you feel happy. But what happens when those things are gone? Joy is not dependent on external factors. It comes from within. Joy is a deep sense of contentment and peace. It is about finding meaning and purpose in your life. It is about feeling connected to something bigger than yourself. When you experience true joy, you feel a deep sense of gratitude for all that you have. We live in a world that tells us happiness is outside of us. Buy this, do that, you will be happy, they say. But true happiness doesn't work that way. It is not something you can buy or achieve. When we chase external things, we are always chasing the next thing. We are never satisfied. We are always looking for something more. This leaves us feeling empty and unfulfilled. Imagine a child on Christmas morning. The child is excited to open presents. They tear through the wrapping paper. They are happy for a little while. But soon the excitement fades. They want more presents. They want more, more, more. We can be like that child. We keep chasing after things. We think they will make us happy. But true happiness is not found in material possessions. It is not found in achievements or accolades. It is found within. True joy comes from inner fulfillment. It comes from aligning with our values. It comes from living a life that is true to ourselves. When we do this, we feel a deep sense of peace and contentment. Think about a time you felt truly happy. What were you doing? Who were you with? What were you thinking and feeling? Chances are you were engaged in something you were passionate about. You were connecting with loved ones. You were feeling grateful for the good things in your life. When we focus on external validation, we give away our power. We allow others to dictate our worth. But when we find our validation from within, we are unstoppable. We are no longer swayed by the opinions of others. We are free to be ourselves. Inner fulfillment is not a destination. It is a journey. It is a process of self-discovery and growth. It is about learning to love and accept ourselves for who we are. When we embrace our true selves, we unlock a level of joy that is truly transformative. I have met many people who thought happiness came from outside. Then they found out it comes from inside. The stories are inspiring. They teach us that true joy is possible for everyone. 
I once interviewed a woman named Maya. Maya had everything she thought she wanted. She had a successful career. She had a loving family, but she was not truly happy. She felt empty inside. One day Maya decided to make a change. She started meditating. She began to focus on gratitude. Slowly she began to find joy within. Another guest was a young man named David. David grew up in poverty. He faced many challenges in his life. But David had a secret weapon, his attitude. David chose to focus on the positive. He found joy in the simple things. He learned to appreciate what he had. David's story teaches us that joy is a choice. These stories remind us that true joy is possible for everyone. No matter what our circumstances may be, we can choose to focus on the good. We can choose to find joy in the present moment. We can choose to live a life that is full of meaning and purpose. Gratitude is one of the most powerful tools for cultivating joy. When we are grateful, we focus on the good in our lives. We appreciate the blessings we have. This shifts our perspective from scarcity to abundance. Think about all the things you are grateful for. Your health, your family, your friends, your home, your job. Take a moment to really appreciate these things. Feel the gratitude in your heart. When you focus on gratitude, you train your mind to see the positive. You start to notice the good things you might have overlooked before. You begin to appreciate the little things. This can lead to a greater sense of happiness and contentment. Start a gratitude journal. Each day, write down three things you're grateful for. They can be big or small. The more you focus on gratitude, the more you will experience its transformative power. Mindfulness is another powerful tool for cultivating joy. Mindfulness is about being present in this moment. It is about paying attention to our thoughts, feelings and sensations without judgment. When we are mindful, we are not dwelling on the past. We are not worrying about the future. We are fully engaged in the present moment. This allows us to appreciate the beauty of life as it unfolds. There are many ways to practice mindfulness. You can try meditation. You can try mindful breathing exercises. You can simply focus on your senses. Pay attention to what you see, hear, smell, taste and touch. Mindfulness helps us to slow down. It helps us to appreciate the simple things. It helps us to connect with ourselves. When we are mindful, we are more likely to experience joy in our everyday lives. We all make mistakes. We all experience setbacks. It's a part of life. But holding on to past hurts and regrets will only keep us stuck in the past. It prevents us from experiencing true joy. Forgiving ourselves and others is essential for finding joy. When we hold on to anger and resentment, we are only hurting ourselves. Forgiveness is not about condoning someone else's actions. It's about freeing ourselves from the pain of the past. Life is not perfect. It's messy and unpredictable. But that is what makes it so beautiful. When we embrace imperfection, we allow ourselves to experience the full spectrum of human emotions. We open ourselves up to the possibility of joy, even in the midst of challenges. Remember, you are not your mistakes. You are not your past. You are worthy of love, forgiveness and joy. Choose to let go of what no longer serves you and embrace the beauty of imperfection. Human beings are social creatures. We are wired for connection. When we connect with others, we feel a sense of belonging. We feel loved and supported. This is essential for our well-being and happiness. Make an effort to nurture your relationships. Spend quality time with loved ones. Engage in meaningful conversations. Build each other up. Celebrate each other's successes. Giving back to others is a powerful way to cultivate joy. 
when we help others, we shift our focus from ourselves to something larger than ourselves. This gives us a sense of purpose and fulfillment. Find a cause you are passionate about, volunteer your time, donate to a charity. Even small acts of kindness can make a big difference. When you give back to others, you're not only making the world a better place, but you're also enriching your own life. When we live a life of purpose and meaning, we tap into a deep well of joy. We feel a sense of fulfillment that comes from aligning with our values and making a difference in the world. Take some time to reflect on your values. What is important to you? What do you want to stand for? What kind of legacy do you want to leave behind? Once you have a clear understanding of your values, you can start to live a life that is in alignment with them. This may involve making some changes to your career, your relationships, or your lifestyle. Remember, your purpose does not have to be something grand or extraordinary. It can be something simple, like being a loving parent, a supportive friend, or a compassionate neighbour. The important thing is that it is something that gives you a sense of meaning and fulfilment. The journey to unlocking joy is a personal one. There is no one-size-fits-all approach. What works for one person may not work for another. The key is to experiment with different practices and find what resonates with you. Be patient with yourself. Cultivating joy is a lifelong practice. There will be ups and downs along the way. But don't give up. The more you invest in your own happiness, the more joy you will experience. Remember, you deserve to be happy. You deserve to experience joy in your life. Embrace the practices that bring you joy. Let go of what no longer serves you and step into a life that is filled with purpose, meaning and true happiness. Ready to unlock true joy and transform your life. Start practicing mindfulness, gratitude and self-compassion today. If you found this video helpful, please like, share and subscribe for more life-changing insights. Let's embark on this journey to lasting happiness together.